Hi, my name is Rorona Lewis and I'm here to tell my story. I'm a young African-American woman from Brownsville, Pennsylvania. I've been attending Brownsville Area School District since the age of six. As a child, I was very ignorant to the fact of racism and what racism is and how it could actually take part in the community. Most black people in my school are black students who are very much kind of silenced on what we can talk about or what we can speak about. We were only put on spot when someone else, uh, someone else that was not of color gave us a spotlight to speak. Otherwise, we were labeled and overlooked. Throughout my years of high school or even elementary school, I've never really got to celebrate Black History Month as a whole. It was either my black fellow students or every every other student in our school that had to teach each other on what black history was or what it actually meant. But we could only do that when we got the time to. I feel that I want our voices to be heard and I refuse to be silenced. For example, this year I took it upon myself to make a PowerPoint on why racism is not okay and why racism should not be, not be normalized. I've also made a valid point on why black history should be celebrated and why it is important. After the superintendent received our PowerPoint and received the message I sent to him, he gladly responded to what I sent to him and he told me that he was ready for him and his team to work together on putting a diversity team together. He reached out to me three days later with some very good news. I was so excited and happy. He told me how he understood my points and how him and his team are ready to come together to create a diversity team. I was so shocked to hear this news. My school is actually going to incorporate a mandatory diversity class, not on just black history, but all type of different parts of diversity. There are also going to be other events in our school that's going to educate kids on the general hospitality and respect for black people and other people in our school. I'm a senior and I'm not just doing this for me, I'm doing this for my fellow black students and the students coming up. I want us all to be able to understand each other and have a mutual understanding on why we should all treat each other with respect. I felt as though it was not my responsibility or other black students' responsibility to teach each other on black history. All American history is black history. And when I'm gone, I would love to see everyone else that comes up after me to take part in these different diversity activities and help everyone come together and understand each other.